Right, afternoon everyone, hopefully everyone is all well. Uh, let's flick this over, there we go. Uh, welcome back everyone to another Trainston World 2 live stream. We're back on the Reza Dresden route today and hopefully you can actually hear me then as the mic was uh, a fair distance away. There we go, that might be better. Um, but yeah, we're on the uh, Reza Dresden again and we're just going to do a couple of runs on the fast line. Uh, but let's see who we've got and we have got Daniel, Metra, Amela, um, the train guy, laser jet average, 3674, Richie, how is everybody doing? Hopefully everyone's all well. The bus flipping. Hello, Tizer, how are you? Anyway, Navica, Dresden, uh, and we're going to do a 101 service. That's what we're going to start off with, the DBBR 101. Obviously, this is a layer, so you need to own the DLC. Uh, let's do... Oh, there's only a seven-minute one. We're not going to do that, obviously. Let's do Dresden to Colm. Early morning? No, do 801, that will do. Dresden to Colm. Hello, Mason, yeah. Yeah, good to hear, Daniel, good to it. Yeah, but hopefully everyone's all well this evening. I thought we'd already loaded in then. Um, right, uh, let's do the doors. So, pop the reverser in. Set that to forward. Uh, train lights, let's get them on. Get them to that. You've got the brake key. First time driving it on the next gen version, so that's why we're going to have all that going off. Good to hear it, she. Yeah, I've been good, mate. You picked up on the road today. Awesome. How are you finding it? Hello, Russian dog. Get all these bits and bobs on. Uh, make sure that's set to headlights. And release the parking brake. Cool. Yeah, good to hear, Mella. I'm good. Um, AFB. Yes, that's very important as well. Cool. There we go. Yeah, hopefully everyone's all well uh, on this, was it Sunday, Sunday evening? Well, so we have got the members only stream tonight and that will be in about an hour and 15 minutes. So we're only going up for an hour on here. Right, 25 minutes to dress the new stat. Let's get going, let's get the AFB up. Yeah, the members only stream tonight will be on Bus Simulator, Bus Simulator 21 multiplayer. Hello Sam, how are you? Caught a southeastern diversion via Catford Bridge, Bromley South and Lewisham today. Awesome. Let's go. Bits and bobs again, yeah. Can you open the windows? Uh, in a bit, possibly. I don't want it to be too loud, then you can't hear me. Cool. Let's uh, unrelease ourselves already. On busing, it's a glitch that I can't assign custom controls to my steering. Well, let's get that off as well. I reckon I can do that one. Uh, probably a glitch, Russian dog, yeah. Been watching the F1 Crazy Race, Autumn Richie. Let's see if. Uh, up to 120. It's a fairly slow part of the route, this bit. I mean, when you look at this bit here, you think, oh, probably that's going to be the fastest part of the route, as it's literally a straight line. It's only 120. Hello, Pivers. I haven't no, I haven't made some. Cool, going across the bridge out of Reza. And let's get the speed up, up to 120. Pivers, you've driven this route yet, mate? There's a Talent 2, a 6 car one. It'll be a Regional Express 50 service. And almost looked like the driver had the blind down there. Looked like it. <laughs> I see you, laser jet. Takes a bit of time getting used to. Lovely Daniel. Cool. But yeah, we'll do this service and then next we'll go in the ice and go back to Reza. Hello Luke, how are you? So a couple, we we'll pretty much will return to Dresden. Oh, I'll see you Cool. But yeah, hopefully everyone's having a good Sunday. Saving road signs as well, there is, look. They've even added in road signs. What's that say on there? What's it say? They've actually got road signs. I mean, it's saying, you know, little, but, you know, there's road signs. Oh, I see Russian, uh, Russian dog. Yeah, how many coaches are we? Yeah, I'll see for it, yeah. 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we're not the largest one you can get. Obviously, that's eleven cars. Let's whiz ahead past the construction site. Let's go to about here. Oh, we've got a freight train as well. Even better. That's going just off that way. That one's off. There it goes. Sounds good to you with us, mate. Yeah, I'll do it on the PlayStation. If we do have any PC members, then I'll move over about halfway through. Good to see you, Luke. But yeah, this is the top speed for most of the journey. On this route right now, doing a regional service. I think you'll beat me to Dresden. Probably, Richie, if you're doing uh, the Regional Express 50. That one does take uh, a little while to do. Well, about 55 minutes. Yes, yeah, so there we go, Seafoot. But what is everyone's favourite service to do on this route? Do you like doing the fast ones on the fast line, or do you like going through all the little villages on the slow line? What do you prefer the most? Cool. But the speed does go up to 160 once we get onto the bypass line. Yeah, just go ahead all the way down. Coming up on oh, what's this one? I always forget this one. It's um, begins with G. I can't remember it though. Gabizel, no, it's not that is it? Always forget the name of this station. Don't know. Got bits of sand, I know. Hello, Neil. How are you, mate? How are you getting on with uh, the route, mate? Reads of Dresden. So the next station is Nuncritz, which is about... Uh, no, it's not a kilometre down, is it? A bit further than that. Awesome, Mason. I quite like the Dresden Codswig, uh, eventually Meissen services. Yeah, they're nice, the S-Bahn ones. You know, half an hour, a nice mix of speed and all that. And yeah, when it goes to mice, and even better, as that looks really nice. Glorious one, yeah. What TSW route should I drive when 20 mile two loads? Do some southeast and high speed. Here's a uh, Nuncrit station, and then it's uh, Weizig, I believe it is next, and that's all sort of the abandoned chemical plant station. Hello DJ Kai, how are you? Do you think that Dovetail Games are adding the branch line? Because the Brighton main line is not complete by a month or so. They're adding this to please us. Uh, well, I think they're just adding it because they're adding it. But they did actually explain, I think, in one of the streams why they're adding it. So I think there's a couple of people working away on it. So it wasn't the whole team. Good to know, I'm good. Good, good. All right, Mason. That'd be awesome, Daniel. On your bus and console, are you having minor rendering and graphic glitches? Uh, no, not on the PlayStation 5. I I've had the stuttering on the PlayStation 4. But, I mean, that's sort of to be expected for games coming out now on last gen. As you see, you know, next gen's out. There's uh, the chemical plant, look at that. So we make our way through. Now oh, pivots. But yeah, we'll be doing bus in multiplayer as a member stream after this. Yeah, this one's uh, Wysig, I believe. But the abandoned station. I wonder what date actually did get abandoned. So it looks fairly up to date. Welcome back, average YouTuber. So soon enough, we'll be coming off the slow line and getting onto the fast line, which takes us all the way the rest of the way into Dresden. Well, to Coswick. And I saw 130 there. Well, that doesn't last for long, though, I don't think. 
Hello, Mr. Adams. What's your opinion on the ability to leave the sta to leave the station? What do you mean, like in this game where you could then go for a walk around, say, Reading Town Centre, you could go for a walk around it? Uh, well, that would be a bit odd because obviously it's a train sim world, not a walk sim world around certain places. Uh, that's not. I don't think it's for us. That's if we were going left. I mean, it has the arrow to indicate. But I'm going to acknowledge it anyway. Yeah, that's if you're going off that way. It goes to 120. Awesome average YouTuber. I'm good, Mr. Adams. I'm good, mate. Cool. But yeah, the slow line's going off, so now we're on the fast line, which means we can go up to 160. So 100 miles an hour. Let's go. See if, uh, walks him around certain places. I mean, one thing I, I, I would like to see. Hello, Duckington. Awesome. Yeah, one thing I, would, I wouldn't mind is, um, sort of, um, Rusil Gnord actually has it. There's, like, paths to the side of the track, like, secret paths, and they go up to, like, vantage points of the track, which is quite cool. But I wouldn't mind, sort of, paths... Also, if they're there in real life, um, so we can just walk along the, you know, a little bit away from the track. Well, no, something like that. That'd be cool. Right, let's uh, get a flyby shot. Let's go ahead. Hello, Rob. How are you? Going ahead. Yeah, but like the Rusty Nord secret paths. They're quite cool. There he goes. Cool. Let's get back in. Yes, Sifa, you want to have a go at us? Should uh, go over the Grossenhain branch in a second. I think it's coming up now, I believe. Yeah, here's the Grossenhain branch. Not a walking around London game. There it is. There's the Grossenhain branch. So we're on a fairly high embankment at the moment as we sort of whiz our way through the fields. But the thing is, it is the fast line. I mean, it, in all, it's not actually much faster than than the um, than the slow line. I'm guessing it's more, you know, saying it can free up some traffic on the slow line, so you know, get delays. But I reckon if you want full speed, we'll, we'll do a race at some point. I reckon if you want full speed down the slow line and then on the fast line, there wouldn't be much of a difference. Awesome duck is in what has got a night enhancement to it. And we're joining it off this line. No idea where this one goes. Yes, yeah, Sifa. Cool. <laughs> what are you even like? Well, some people want to fly planes, Rob, in, in, in train sim as well. I come and try and get up to 30 likes. We've got 32 P points. Thanks all for spending some time this evening watching me drive a 101. Much appreciated. Obviously the modern 101. I don't think it's fast because trains that go in don't have to uh, be stuck. With, yeah, like pretty much uh, Russian dog. Just frees up space on the other line. Right, I think there will be a warning board soon for a 120. It does drop quite a bit on this, and then goes back up and then drops. And cool. But yeah, now we're a few days. Uh, oh. Uh. I think I missed something. Yeah, I missed. I must have missed the 120 board. I don't know when I missed that, but I don't know. Hello, Adam. How are you? Oh, I see. Yeah, I must have missed the warning board. Was there a warning board? Don't I? I didn't see a warning. Didn't you see one? Hello, Adam. How are you? 
Roughly 25 miles an hour slower. Uh, Alright, let's get going again. Didn't see any. Well, I don't know. The Grossenheim service is a contender for the best services as well. Fair enough. Don't take long to get going. Train. Move. Oh, I mean, it's a good screenshot opportunity, I guess. There we go. Train, you need to get going. Come on. There we go. That's actually not bad stopping there. There you go. <laughs> I missed it, did I, Sander? Uh, must not have been paying attention then. Well, off we go again. Cool. Well, let's get going. We'll just tell the passengers there was a red light. I'm sure the uh, I'm sure it's already been done. Is this the train? Uh, this is the British Rail Class 101. No, this is the DBBR 101. Well, off we go. Cool. So it's one twenty now. Let's bring that down. Cool. Yeah, brilliant. Uh, Loco, the one hundred and one. Uh, obviously, this is actually from the uh, Hobstrecker Ryan Rue. Well, it's a DLC for the Hobstrecker Ryan Rue, which then layers onto this. The brakes are still on, I'm pretty certain. I can hear something. A squealing sound. That'll be alright. Has it gone now? I don't know. Awesome, Mr. Quicko. I'm guessing you're, you're glad that you got it in the end. Well, we've got the member stream after this, and that'll be multiplayer on it. Fair enough, Mr. Quicko. I do like playing without a hard a lot, fair enough, Sander. <laughs> Hello Shayna, how are you doing? Oh blimey, Miss Quicko, quite a bit then. Yeah, Sifa, there we go. Yeah, make our way down the uh, slow line, and well, like the fast line. In a minute, we should actually be able to see the slow line, which is next to us. There it is, there on the other side of the field in the cutting. That's where the other line is. So at some points, they are very close. And can we try and get up to 25 likes? That would be brilliant. Hello, William. How are you? Lovely, Miss Quicko. I yeah, move that a little bit. There we go. That's a bit better. You're doing 26 miles an hour on a 1.5% grade in a 35 miles an hour zone. All oh, right. I'm struggling to get up then. But yeah. After this, we'll then do a service in the ice, and we'll go back to Reza. Yes, yeah, Sifa. Good to see you, I'm good. I reckon probably, what, 10 minutes until we get to Dresden? It doesn't take too long. Hello, Darko, how are you? As we are running pretty much as fast all the way down. Is this a speedboard coming up? Yes, a 140. Let's um, pop that up. 140. Cool. I accidentally put the emergency brake on at Coswig. Ah. Yeah, is everyone looking forward to the uh, mice and branch? And there's a 160. Seems pointless to put the 140 there. I suppose there's reasons for, I suppose, the freight trains. I don't know. Not good here, William, mate. We'll take it easy, mate. Yeah, not good, mate. 
yeah, we'll sit back and uh, I suppose relax and try and uh, enjoy the stream. So you felt yes, I've got you. So we are whizzing along through here. I think this is part of Coswig, this is. Good evening, Daniel. How are you? Hopefully you're doing well. No, actually, no, probably not part of Coswig. Coswig's down there. Don't know another part of it. Good to hear, Darko. Yeah, I'm good. What is your opinion about the new route? It's brilliant. Lots of variety, lots of different ways to go. It's fast, busy. It's brilliant. Obviously, if you want to see my whole breakdown and review of the route, I've done a, quite a long Steam review of it. Uh, I think it was over a thousand characters or something. Cool, we're getting there. But yeah, I think we're due in, in four minutes into Dresden New Stat, I think. I think it was 25. Yeah, four minutes to go 14 kilometres. I don't think we're going to be doing that. <laughs> I don't know if we left late. I mean, I know we did obviously come to a stop, but that was not for long. That was that 30, 40 seconds. Well, we might be able to get there in four minutes, but I doubt it. Right, I got one for a 130. It's not peas that'd be uh, guarded, though. Locked in my son's room with COVID watching you, but okay. <laughs> Lovely, Daniel. Well, right, take it easy, mate. I'm sure you will recover very soon. You love having a local bus now being the small Alexander Dennis. Awesome. Yeah, we'll be going over the, uh, well, the Coswig slow line in a second. Ah, oh, fair enough, William. Yeah, I'm good. Evening, uh, Pete. How are you, mate? Viewing our way round. Yeah, but we're joining back up with the uh, sort of slow lines now. There they are, underneath and to the side. So this is sort of the main line sprint now into uh, Dresden. I mean, we've got 11 kilometres in three minutes. Yeah, that's not happening. <laughs> Probably a minute or two late. Oh, I see you, uh, Mr. Good Guy. Hello, um, Scottish, how are you, mate? I'm good. Bow down to Sir Pete. Right, I should be able to get up to 160 soon. I think I might have actually missed the speedboard. No, I think this speedboard's here, isn't it? Yeah, 160. Let's get up. I can see an S Barn service coming up as well. There we go. Back up to 100 miles an hour. Alright, it's 160 for a while, so let's uh, get a flyby shot. I see. I'm seriously thinking of purchasing the season ticket to get this route today. Are there any problems with it on PS5? Um, no. Uh, I mean, personally, obviously, I'm playing on the PlayStation 5. I've had no issues at all with um, well, Boston and. Um, Navica Dresden. Yeah, it's been uh, it's been fine for me on the PlayStation. I love the new AI in Bus Sim too. Awesome. Well, there's the biggest uh, variety of AI, isn't there? Oh, awesome, Rob, mate. I guess that was on flight sim. Let's see, how long have we got now? We've we've got we've got one minute to go 6.8 kilometres. Yeah, that's that's um that's what happening. The lighting on it is excellent. Yes, this has the night enhancement to it, so obviously it looks better at night. Um, much better. Um, and also the autumn enhancement as well. 
You found a few issues on the PlayStation 5. Some of the journey mode trips don't actually include a train. Oh, yes. Yeah, the, some on service mode as well. But, I mean, nothing, you know, game-changing. You've just overtaken me. Lovely, Richie. Your PC is playing up. Ah, oh, so I'll get to any more the bus. I have Mr. Quicko, yeah, he's the uh, race guy, the F1 guy. Hello, a NJ, how are you? There's another talent, too. Yeah, it's brilliant, isn't it, Rob? I mean, same for Hamburg to Lubeck. I was very happy we had the 101 layer on there, too. Um, definitely my favourite German train to drive. It's just got something about it. It's just brilliant. Hello, Davidoff, I'm good, how are you? Probably also because it's got the new coaches on the back as well, which I really do like driving. Let's see, so we're due there now, and we're still 3.5 kilometres out. So maybe that stop actually did affect us. I mean, it was only for 30, 40 seconds, but still. It needs a new heat sink. Ah. Should start bringing our speed down soon. <laughs> true, Pete. You're true. But obviously there are other ones you're able to do. You wish busting was cross-platform? Fair enough. What's well, cross-gen? Well, I mean, it would be as it's just there's only one addition of it. But yeah, look at the lighting on that spire there. At night time, that looks... I mean, even at daytime, it looks brilliant. But at night, it's uh, beautiful. Right, that is guarded by PZB, so we do need to come down very quickly. I actually don't know if we're going to make it, actually. That's... No, we should be able, Should be all good. I think I see ice coming up. There you go, we should be all good. Same with that other spire over there. You've got the uh, lighting on it. Sort of the spotlights going up, which are brilliant. Awesome, Rob. You made my mind up, Joe. I'm buying the season ticket now. That should help me pass my isolation time. Awesome, uh, Daniel, mate. Well, you have a, a lot to get on, obviously. Boston, Sprinter, and uh, Navico, Dresden. Lots and lots to do on each route. Enjoy it, mate. Thing is, what one are you going to play first? Are you going to play the German route or the American route? Here we are. This is Dresden New Stat Station. Arriving about two minutes late. See if it yet. Cool. Hello, Noah. How are you? Dresden New Stat. And you've got to stop, I'm pretty certain on the last stop marker. Well, the one that, at the end of the canopy. That's where I usually stop. No, no, the train, not here. No, no, you're not stopping here. A little bit further on, and then you can stop. Yeah, I believe you're supposed to set, stop on this one. Here we are. But yeah, just a reminder, if you want to drive this train on the Navico Dresden, you do need the Hobstrecker Ryan Rue and the 101 DLC. Uh, I had a bit of extra time, David off, so I got back earlier than expected, so I thought I'd uh, stream TSW2 now, obviously, you know, for everyone, and obviously do the member stream a bit later on. Take your fire because you're late. That wasn't too bad. Doors closing. Yeah, it's he's uh, I I like in. Two minutes late, that's not bad. Right, Dresden hold to ban off next, which we might even get there. No, probably not on time. The German route, I love the new lighting. I didn't realise there was new season settings. Well not new season settings but in autumn it looks better than the other seasons a bit like on the boston sprinter it's sort of got that winter feel to it so they the um 
well they've pretty much made it just look better in winter um various little things changed um it just looks better and this one is autumn so if you drive this route in autumn it will just look much better than if you did another route in autumn Hello Will, the 101 seems to work fine for me and I don't own Hubstrick or Ryan Maru. Maybe you can get it without Hubstrick or Ryan Maru, but... Uh, um, is that on PC, Will? I think on console it does say you need to own that DLC, then you can get it. What platform will be multiplayer be on tonight? Well, it's members only. Um, and, well, it really depends if... If there's no PC multiplayer people, then we'll just do it on the PlayStation. But if not, we'll switch it around halfway. Fair enough, Pete. Yeah, you got to love the branch line. Cool. Hey, Amanda, how are you? I guess some people are really fussed about the upcoming bus from 20 multiplayer. I can't say I'll enjoy this stream. Of course we go. So obviously the only one I can't do multiplayer would be Xbox, but I can do PS and PC. I think it's actually a bit faster here, I'm going a bit slow. Where do you even be a member? Uh, there should be a join button below, or oh, Nightbot does uh, occasionally put links in the comments. I think it's even in the description as well, I believe. Yeah, I think it is in the description. So I think I added it in there. You're getting Bus from 20 Extended Edition for your birthday. Awesome. I think you get the uh, bus pack for the MAM one and the skin packs, which are quite cool. There should be a link below, Mr. Quicker. Or Nightbot uh, usually puts one in. I'm just uh, checking, but I believe there is. Yeah, so it's in the description. There's a link um, for the members. Sit straight, yeah. There we go. Sounds good, Rob. Yeah, coming in to uh, Dresden. Imagine Bus Sim 20 on map extension to an airport. Well, Seaside Valley is in it, and that's got the uh, airport in it. But yeah, the new one will be called to have an airport. I mean, I'm sure they'll do DLC for it, so you never know. Amanda is telling Joe off again. Hello, Kobe. I'm good. How are you? So yeah, arriving a couple of minutes late into Hulk Ban off station. And then we're going to go on the ice and go back up. Even in Artful, how are you? Ah, oh, CNJ. Well, it's day one, isn't it? Day one edition, so I suppose you can only get it on day one. Would you believe it's 60 across there? It seems dangerous. It's up straight. <laughs> yeah, see that. Here we are. Yeah, it's a gorgeous station, Dresden Hold the Banoff. Obviously, you've got the, I suppose, through platforms, and then you've also got the terminating platforms down below. So it's lovely. Uh, it should be sorted now, Munchies. Um, change it from the main menu. Don't change it in game. Um, that might also work. But on the PlayStation, that's been sorted. <laughs> Fair enough, Artful. Hopefully, you're enjoying it, mate. Enjoy it. Or at least enjoying it a little. Yeah, I'm sure, I enjoy it. Yeah, see if that. 
It is Richie, yeah. Right, you got to be fairly careful as there is a red at the end of the platform. Here we are, dressed in Hoth Banner. So, but we're going to go on the Ice Free next. We'll see the 406. Look at that. Well, I think I've already got a screenshot like that from the PC version. So, But I'll take one anyway. Like an L185. There it is. Obviously, of the new one containers. Which has anyone checked? But do you get the new containers on the other routes now? Because uh, was it main spec up barn? I think you get the new ones, don't you? You found a bus on Great Western Express with buffers. You found a bus on Great. Oh, or a bug. I see J Luke. There we go. Oh, I see you, NJ. Right, let's go back up to the main menu. Well, it depends, what, I suppose, what platform you're playing on, if it was crashing. Back drive and the bin lorries on green waste next week, so grass leaves and garden waste. Oh, I see that for. Um, timetable, uh, 4.06. Uh, let's do it to autumn, just so you can sort of see, you know, the enhancement. We'll go for November. Was that really that's more winter, isn't it? Now nah, we're going November. Um, and let's go from Dresden. Yeah, we'll go Dresden to. Yeah, that will do. Uh, hmm. Yeah, let's do a nice evening run as the sun's going down, all the trees orangey with the sun on them. What does the N word mean in this DLC? Can't spell it for a toffee. Uh, Navica. Um. Navica Dresden, I'm guessing St. Railway Dresden or Commuter Dresden, I'm not really too sure. I'm sure it's a German word for something. So obviously the route is actually called Barnstrecker Riesa Dresden. But obviously, with sort of the name changes, obviously now London Commuter and Boston Sprinter. I suppose Navica might be, I don't know, Commuter Dresden or something like that, I don't know. Or, I don't know um, what Navica means. I'm sure Google Translate's a handy tool there. Oh, I see munchies. Right, let's get the doors open. But yeah, this gives you a chance to see the night lighting whilst it's actually still day, and also the autumn um, enhancement on here. And the lighting enhancement. I mean, they're just brilliant. Hello, Cole. What's the good news, mate? Oh, I see. Lovely, yeah. Uh, artful. Uh, let's see what we need to do. Right, passengers need to probably have lighting. But first off, we need to do the pantograph. As on this one, it, it just isn't already set. Uh, let's get the passenger lights on before they will complain it's too dark. Uh, AFB. You found bug on Great West Express with the buffers from platform 7 to 13, 14. There are no buffers. Could be realistic if it's been, well, if it's been like that since the beginning. Oh, I see, Carl. That's good then. Local traffic Dresden is the translation. I suppose it is fairly local. Oh, look at look at that. Look at the reflection. I haven't seen that before on on the last gen version. That you can see the reflection of all the lights there on the glare of the window. It's more noticeable if I turn that. Oh, look at that. I did not notice that before. Look at that. That is that is pretty cool. Well, it's all were uh, you know like that. Right. Let's see. Let's um. Get the safety systems on. Uh, I think we are then ready to go. Let's set that up to 40. And let's go. Dresden, you stat next. Local transport, Dresden. Ah. I think it sounds better in German, though. Never occurred, Dresden. Right, off we go. Yeah, it gives you a chance to see the new night lighting and also the autumn enhancement on the route by doing it at this time. You get a bit of both. Off we go. Up to 60. Cool, we are off. But yeah, I love the lighting coming out of Dresden. Have to ban off. It's brilliant. Yeah, see, fair, I've got you. But obviously, yeah, everyone should have the ice free services on this route. Obviously, this ice is actually layered over from the Conchonel Fall Strecker. Um, realistically, I don't think it does run on this way. It might do. 
but I believe they were saying this is sort of the replacement for the iced tea. So I suppose if we ever got an iced tea DLC in future, I suppose then if you bought if you got it, then it would I suppose swap it around. But yeah, it's cool to have the ice on here. And I'm gonna put the lights to bright just so you guys can see maybe a little bit more. What is the best way to make money on the road? Utilize the multi drop system. Okay, maybe it's a little bit dark, um, but it's all good. So I guess as as it's UK, that should be expect delays, London, Brighton. Yeah, I, see, I mean, trains were quite delayed today. I mean, they've been upgrading the line for the last couple of months, and there's probably actually been more cancellations and more faults with the signalling system since, which is a bit like, what's going on? If you're doing busting multiplayer on the PlayStation or busting 21 on member stream, uh, I'm not too sure. Davidoff, if I have a party up, probably not. Hello, Osman. Uh, now that Dresden is out, BML is up next. I'm excited for that. Awesome. The T stood for tilting. Oh. Yeah, it's uh, brilliant, isn't it, Munchies on Hamburg Lubeck? Mm -hmm. Yeah, obviously, once you've completed the mastery, you get the fair. I think we probably can speed up. I probably am going a bit slow. Yeah, I think it's 80 along here. I don't know why I'm sticking to this speed for. Let's get that up. That's all that pivots. Give it a couple of months. Yeah, it was 80. We've got a warning for a 60 again. Well, we did have a warning for a 60. Now it's gone, but I acknowledge that anyway. Maybe I should bring it down. It, did, it was saying it. Hello, Brandon. I'm good. How are you? The best way to make money in ETS is to let a metal dry frown hit and everything. Yeah, that's a good way to <laughs> make money. Let's uh, bring the speed down. Yeah, look at the lighting there. That's one of the things. Look, the whole of the sort of old part of the city is all lit up. Look at that. Yeah, see if that. And we've got 50. Let's bring that down. Cool, coming into Dresden, your stat station. But hopefully, you guys can see something. Hopefully, it's not too dark. Here we are, is that a Dresden Airport service over there? Uh, possibly. I think they have released the schedule artful, and I believe the answer to that is no. Oh, I see Brandon. Oh, I see. Yeah, not good to hear. Okay, now another train, another freight service going through. Look at that. Awesome. Stop at the end of the canopy. See, every time I get a freight service, it's the containers. So, can are that, is that background AI freight, or can you actually drive those freight services? I suppose you probably can. Here we are. Actually, that's probably the other freight, actually. That's probably the... Um, one, I can't remember what it's called. Ruderitz or something. Hello, Josh. How are you? I'm good. Love the background noises. But yeah, look at the lighting there as well. That's, obviously, that was the spire we passed, but it's all lit up. And obviously, if you look at other routes and look at spires, it'll also be pitch black at this time. But yeah, look, it's, um, it's all lit up, which is cool. It really does look good. How you doing, Alex? You can see the whole of the old area lit up as well. And that's another thing about this route. I swear you can see further into the distance. There's more. They've sort of well, they've modelled more into the distance. So there's a lot you can see. A lot. It's almost like the whole city's being modelled. You can see all the way over there, and it's awesome. Uh, TS 2022 preview next week. That'll be cool, artful. Obviously, that's going to be the Frankfurt to Um 
the Birmingham Cross City line and Washington to Baltimore. But yeah, look at the reflection though of the buttons on their front screen. That looks really good. I just got a stare. It's brilliant. Uh, the only branch line on this line doesn't even cover the whole branch itself. Well, it goes up to Grossenhain, and that's well, it's called the Grossenhain branch because it goes to Grossenhain. Right, let's get the brakes off and reset in 42 kilometres. Let's go. Good to Alex, I'm good, mate. Yeah, see ya, Josh. Thanks for coming, in, mate. Take care. We've got 31 people in. Can we try and get up to 35 likes? We've got 31 at the moment. Obviously, thanks all for joining me on a nice evening autumn service on the Reza to Dresden. I thought we'd do it in the dark so you guys can see that obviously the new night lighting. And also, set it to autumn because that's got the autumn enhancement to it. Awesome artful. Don't actually have Frankfurt's cobble end, so I might try and get it at some point now. Snake and eye out of uh, Dresden and you that now. I haven't been able to yet, Mr. Quicko, although someone said earlier you have to get quite far through the campaign to then unlock it, so I don't know if the introduction is pretty much how you, to do everything, then you unlock it. I thought the introduction might just be, you know, the first mission or the tutorial. But I think it's quite a, I think, way you have to go to unlock it. And up to 160. But yeah, Pete, how are you getting on with uh, Bustin 21, mate? How long will how long will you be until the members stream? Well, it's quarter two, so do you say it to Amanda. I'm going to dim the lights so you can see the new lighting model. Pete, <laughs> possibly. Yeah, it's brilliant, isn't it, Andrew? There's one four six. Oh, that's weird, that FPS drop there. don't know. Another freight service. Very heavy freight on this route. A lot of freight. So if you like your freight stuff, this is a route for you. That's got a bit of everything on here. See, for, yes. Let's get a flyby shot. Let's uh, whiz ahead. Yeah, fair enough, Pete, mate. And let's watch the train going. Look at the moon down on there. Awesome. What have we got? I've got a warning for all a. No, that's not a warning, that's just telling us. Well, I suppose that means Reza are on there. Yeah, it does look good. Nice evening run. I can see a talent. Is that a talent? Yeah, talent two coming in. Or oh, just coming out of whatever it's just well, the next station. I think this is Raid Bull Off station actually. Uh no, I don't think this is Raid Bull Ost. No, it is Raid Bull Ost. Just the building, station building isn't lit up there. Cool. Is the member stream for everyone or not? Well it's for members, uh Luke, mate. So members well, only members can watch it. And that will be at quarter to seven. I'm still on bus sim 21 multiplayer. Getting there though. Start slowing down soon. C30, yes, there we go. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it, NJ? Nice little sort of bonus. 
Hello everyone, what did I miss? Just a run from uh, Reza to Dresden, but we're going back now up to uh, Dresden, so not miss too much, mate. Yeah, it's like my inflation. Obviously, yeah, thanks everyone for coming in. We're getting there. Yeah, but soon we will come off the fast line, go up onto. Well, we'll not come off the fast line, we'll come off sort of the main line section where all the tracks are together and then go off on our own way. What trains do you get with this route stock? Uh, what do you get just with it? A lot. A lot of trains. Um, right, let's quickly bring that down and I'll go over the list. But yeah, you get the 143, the, the 146.2, the 185.5, uh, the Talent 2, uh, the DB3, well, the DBB363, um, uh, the Ice 3, as that comes from Conchner Fast Strecker. Uh, and I think that's all of them, yeah. And obviously then, with, if you've got other German routes, you get the layers, and that's, well, not layers, but the substitutes. <laughs> cool. Yeah, see for... Right, back up to 160 now. Let's get that up. Full whack. Awesome. Have you had any problems getting the 143 moving? Uh, at times, uh, with the AFB, and obviously it was a red square, it didn't really do anything. You simply just have to wait and keep sort of refreshing the AFB from off to on and then it then does it. And I have to wait for the brakes to come off. But yeah, on our way back up to Reza now. And also another thing with this route is reflective signing. So if you look at the headlights, they aren't very bright on this one as opposed to others. You can sort of see the signs reflecting back at us. Which is cool. Do you think they should include the native trains on this route and layer them over to Hofstrecke Rhein Ruhr? Um, well, I mean, I think you get the upgraded 143 and 146 is on Hofstrecke Rhein Ruhr, so I suppose they sort of have. If you're on about the S Bahn Dresden Dostos, I, I don't, well, you, I suppose you wouldn't have them on. Hopstrecker uh, Rhymer as well wouldn't make sense. Sounds good, Pete. Yeah, a lot of trains you get on there, Jake. How you doing, Jake? What platform are we on? We're on the PlayStation 5, Evan, mate. I think that's where 140 this is. Yeah, 140. Bringing that down, it's, no, it's not too far to a 120 either. Probably with some more realistic, Rob. So yeah, I wonder when the bypass line was actually built on this route. Uh, or maybe it's always been here. Maybe they... Well, I'll show you in a second once we get past this warning board. Right, right down to 120. So it's fairly slow along this section. Uh, but yeah... I suppose maybe the line was always like this, but maybe this bit here wasn't built, so you sort of just went up and up to there, wherever that goes. But I suppose maybe later on they then added this bit here, which sort of links the two up. That's what I'm thinking. Alright, NJ. Tifa, yes, I've got yeah. But it's nice to show this route off in the dark. 
And it won't be long at this time in the evening, it will be the start. What is it? It's uh, half four at the moment. So yeah, not long and it will be like this at this time at night. Give it a month or so. Actually, no, I think this is in November we've done this one, so yeah, give it a couple of months, two, three months, and it will be like this in the evening. Oh, two months, actually. You got Hubstra Karimo with the Collector's Edition. Awesome, uh, NJ, mate. Well, I know some people, yeah, only do buy the British routes. Some people only buy the American routes. Some buy, well, some people only buy routes, you know, German ones, or maybe even you might just own LGV and then the base ones. Obviously, that is the uh, awesome thing about Trains in World 2. You don't have to get every single DLC. You can just get the ones you want, uh, you know, for your collection. Obviously, if you don't if you don't like German trains, then don't get the German routes. You know, you get to pick what routes you want. And obviously, there's a massive variety of routes. That's true, NJ. Obviously, do remember there are the obviously older preserved routes which are uh, which are brilliant as well. And obviously, are being upgraded over time. Look at the golden sun. As I suppose so, Rob. I guess. I think I just missed a speedboard then. I think it's back up to 140 now. Well, I think it's gone back up. And obviously, yeah, obviously I did my campaign walkthrough, well, career walkthrough for Bus Sim 21 this morning. Hopefully, that will also help you guys out. So, if you're stuck on a mission, you can then see how I did it. Um, but yeah, hopefully, that has helped out maybe some people for couple of the missions. Do you have any model trains? I have quite a few. Yeah, quite a few. Yeah, Sifa, have some of that. Yeah, that's true, Rob. I think it is still 120. You're planning on buying Rhyme Rock Austin, so I get the S bar for Colin Arkin. Fair enough. No, here's the uh, speed 160. Let's go. Cool. But yeah, we're going to be going off again in a second and heading towards the slow line. Let's uh, watch it. Let's whiz ahead. Look at that, awesome. Are any of them southern? Um, oh, do I have any southern model, uh, model trains? Surprisingly, uh, no, I don't. There's the uh, southern ones, they're blimmin' expensive. So I want more sort of older companies and models. And Yeah, it's lovely, isn't it, Alex? A nice evening drive. To Reza. Uh, Great Western Express and Long Island also seem like good routes. Yes, they're sure right in jail. Obviously, quite old routes, but still very good. We'll see uh, Great Western running between Reading and Paddington. 35 miles. Obviously, you get that iconic HST and the 166. Uh, and obviously, Long Island Road. Obviously, it's more of a network. We'll see Atlantic Terminal, New York Penn, Hicksville, Hempstead. It's just, yeah, it's a whole network pretty much. And obviously you get the M3, well, no, the M7, and then M3 is DLC if you want to buy it. So they're both brilliant routes. <clears throat> uh, yes, Mr. Quicker, although I do have, I think, one unit, and that's a 158 in the sort of newer, well, not the newer Northern livery, but the, not the old, old one, but the, not the new one. 
I don't think it was used very much. The livery. But yeah, make our way back towards the slow line. There's the Grossenhain branch we're about to pass over. Obviously, you can't really see it, but there it is there. Yeah, I've gone over that now. Let's have a look. We are here. So, about two thirds of the way there. I mean, the slow line section is only about a third of the route. Or well, this sort of where it splits off. All different, Mr. Quicko. All different. Lima, Hornby, Batchman. Yes, yeah, Sifa, have some of that. Well, yeah, thanks all for joining me for a better train drive in this evening. I'll see only one stream um, today, although if you're a member, there will be a member stream which will be starting in around, I'd say, 25 minutes time. Great. I was doing something, what is the best way to make money on, on the road? Uh, best way, um, use the multi-drop system. Yeah, multi-drop system. Utilise it the best you can. So, try and get as much in the back of the lorry as you can. Obviously, all going to the yeah, same-ish place. Now at 130 and it comes down to 120 soon. You've got your dynamic brakes, awesome. But yeah, back up the uh, slow line now. Well, that's still quite a distance to uh, Riza from here. It's still, yeah, 12 kilometres. So we're not that near, you know, we're not anywhere near still. Hey, awesome Russian dog. I'll be on that then at some point. There we go. Cool. <clears throat> oh, I see you, Andre. I guess that's where Atlantic Terminal is. That's where's ahead. Coming up on uh, Wise Big. That does look good though, doesn't it? They've changed Seaside Valley so much. Uh, what what are the noticeable differences, Russian Dog, mate? I haven't been on it yet, but yeah, what's sort of one of the big changes to it? Does it look different? I mean, obviously it would be, but... No, that's probably true, Rob. I mean, obviously, you do get new people to TSW too. Um, and obviously, there's so many routes, which obviously I suppose people might not know about. But yeah, I think this is. I, I've lost count of how many routes there are in this game. There is a lot. I think this is the 27th or 28th route in the game. So, yeah, you're not short on, you know, what, what to do. Oh, I see, Rob. Hello, Swan Adventures, how are you? Well, that's why, you know, if you do have any questions, um, do pop it in the chat and I'll try and answer it about the game, about the routes, you know, any route uh, in the game. I'll tell you, you know, where it goes from, what trains you get and all that. So, uh, yeah, do, if you do have any questions, pop it in the chat. Obviously, if you are looking at getting another route, if you just need some help with something, do let me know. Here's an Uncrit station. That's Globitz, isn't it? Yeah, Globitz. Next one. Oh, I see it, NJ. Atlantic Terminals in Brooklyn. Ah. Yeah, we will be getting Sherman Hill and Horseshoe Curve. Looking forward to them. I'll try and get them on TS and we can show them off. 
Obviously, if you haven't seen it already, do check out my West, uh, well, my Cornish mainline live stream, uh, which sort of gave you an insight into West Cornwall local. Yeah, it's brilliant, isn't it, Rob? 27th total. Wow. Coming up on Nuncrit Station. Actually, this is Globitz. Yeah, what am I on about? Yeah, it's Globitz, this one. Which has got staggered platforms. Through we go. Lovely. But yeah, fairly slow part of the route, this bit. I mean, when you look at it, it's literally a straight line all the way up until we get closer to Reza. You would think it might be, you know, 160. But no, it's, it is surprisingly quite slow, this bit. Nice Metra. I love my West Somerset Railway. Is it worth to get... Uh, to get the TVL and get those layers? Definitely, Kobe, yes. Obviously, if you get the Tees Valley line... The 101 then layers onto <coughs> layers onto the Somerset Railway and adds obviously more services. Uh, then you've got the chance of getting the class 31 uh, and the 20, and then they both layer on as well. So yeah, it's really good. And I think even the 37 goes on there as well. So not too sure, Davidoff, mate. That's one of sort of the low priority games, ATS. So not too sure. Uh, have you ever seen cross country trains at Brighton before? Well, I lived in Brighton when they did run. I don't remember them though. Um, but no, they don't run there anymore. I think the last one was 2007 slash 8. There's probably the RE50. I do, I select multi drop, but just keep picking up loads until it says your truck's full. Uh, you might have to do some calculations to see when it is full, but. Yeah, there's a view eating. I still don't really know what a beef patty is. I know you've explained it, but I always forget. It's like a, like a sausage roll, I don't know. Awesome AC, isn't it? How you doing, AC? Welcome in, mate. Hello, for sure. Awesome Metra. But yeah, we'll be on Bus Sim Multiplayer. Well, Bus Sim 21 after this. Members only multiplayer. Uh, maybe at some point, Davidoff, mate. But as I said, uh, American Truck Sim is one of the. A bit like ETS2, one of the more lower priority games on the channel. Right, let's uh, get the speed down. Yeah, see if that. I'm warning for an 80. There we go. Cool, but yeah, coming into Reza now. But yeah, what did everyone think of that? Obviously, the night lighting, the autumn enhancement. Looks really good, doesn't it? Glenn has become addicted to bus sim. Good on him. Yeah, I'm now um, about the same as the PC version on the campaign. I think I'm on Tame the Dragon. That's the mission I'm on. It's only, I think, what, the 6th or 7th mission, but I'm slowly getting there. Not yet, Pete, no. Yeah, it's lovely, I'm in it. Good to AC, I'm uh, here for the member stream, first time I made, I think. Awesome AC. Uh, yes, I'll be doing multiplayer. Obviously, I've only got a PlayStation and a PC. But if we do have any PC players of Bus in 21, I will halfway through switch over to the PC version. Um, and then we can, obviously, do, yeah, multiplayer on there as well. Fair enough, Rob. Uh, at some point, we will go back um, yeah it's taking a bit of a break I suppose FS19 for now I 
Ten of Rush and Dive. The only thing about bus from twenty on which I do find a bit weird is that the sort of main bus station is uh within probably the most well, the quietest area of the map. That's thing what sort of yeah. It's a bit like eh? Does that mean on the road is low priority? Uh well at the moment I have done on the road in a little while, so I suppose yeah. I mean the sort of games on the channel which I'll give the highest priority to obviously is Train Sim World 2. Uh Train Simulator, that's got a fair bit of priority. Um yeah, sort of the train games at the moment. Well T S W two always be the highest priority one. But anyway, that is going to be it, everyone, for today's Train Some World 2 live stream. Hopefully, everyone did enjoy that. I sure did. Uh, obviously, we'll find a link in the description. Blimey, Glenn. Obviously, you will find a link in the description to the Discord server, to the PayPal, and to the uh, merch store. Oh, if you do want to help support the channel, as you can see our ACS64 merch there. It looks really good. And obviously, it is still 20% off until September the 22nd using the promo code SUMMER20. You've still got time to go. And have a look there's the promo code there but apart from that thanks all for coming in and i hopefully will see you in the next one see members only stream starting in around 15 minutes time but apart from that i'll be back uh tomorrow for anyone else but thanks all for coming in and i hopefully will see you next time see you all and take care not too sure james see ya